Well, here's a stat for you. It's not the best one. Most people will give up on their New Year's resolutions by February 1st. That's tomorrow, about six hours from now. To help you stay on track of your financial goals, our Dan Cummins talked to an expert at Savage & Associates in Maumee in today's Stretching Your Dollar. Dan? All right, how much money do you have right now in retirement? According to data from Vanguard, the average person only has about $140,000 in retirement. Most people think they'll need about $1.25 million by retirement age. Getting to that goal might be the difference between a saver and a spender. And so the studies show that there's you know, a good chunk of the percentage of people out there are woefully underfunded for their retirement. So. According to investment advisor Jeff Turner, he says most people are either savers or spenders. There's a big difference. Savers are more likely to get their financial goals. Again, the savers tend to accumulate money, accumulate investments, and have financial advisors helping them um, because they have, they have assets and investments and, and those kind of instruments. But if you're new to investing, you might not have a financial advisor or even a portfolio to build off of. Turner says it's still possible, but it'll take practice. And I think I've seen people make the leap from a spender to a saver, but it's with a lot of discipline and paying yourself first. That means keep up your resolution to save for retirement till it becomes, as Turner calls it, a habit. Experts say you should be investing about 15 to 20 percent of your income right now per paycheck. With Stretching Your Dollar, I'm Dan Cummins.